In Bravos, a theater troupe stages a play about the War of the Five Kings called The Bloody Hand. Tywin is portrayed by the troupe leader, Izembaro, who recreates Tywin's death on the privy, and mocks Tywin's legacy by portraying him as voiding his bowels just after being shot by Tyrion, to Arya Stark's amusement. While meeting with Yara and Theon Greyjoy in Marine, Daenerys mentions how the fathers of all present in the room, including Tyrion, were evil men who left the world in a worse state than when they were alive. Although Tywin, for all his ruthlessness, was renowned throughout Westeros for maintaining peace through the Seven Kingdoms while serving Ares II. Daenerys goes on to say how she hopes that they leave it in a better state before finalizing a pact with Yara and Theon. Tywin's body is burnt to ash when the Great Sept of Baelor explodes from wildfire in a plot orchestrated by Cersei. His last grandchild, Tommen, later commits suicide after hearing that Marjorie died in the blast and realizing it was his own mother who did it. With House Baratheon extinct, Cersei ascends to the Iron Throne, thus beginning the Lannister dynasty, though her rule is widely opposed.